everyone's so... S oh, hey, ya. Uh... Betty, I'm so glad to see you're okay. You too. Uh, where's Marlene? Is she okay? Don't worry. She's safe. Really? I'm so glad. Hey, can you help me with something? I'm looking for music discs for the jukebox. I think some new music might cheer people up, make them happy. That's a wonderful idea. Okay. If we find any music discs, we'll bring them straight to you. You just promised to crank up the volume, all right? You know I will. Thanks! Thanks a bunch! Wow! What a song! It makes me feel like I can do anything! Yeah! Yeah! I can feel this song calling to my inner warrior! Yeah! I can take on the world! It's time I took action, made a stand! Hell yeah, that's it! That's the fire we need right now! Be a force for change, brother! Don't you think? Um... Is it okay if I stay and listen for a bit? This song is a favorite of mine. Sure! Before. That's wrong! Wrong, wrong, wrong! This is how you get down with this jam. I ought to know. It was my favorite back in the day. Pay attention, kiddo. It's all in the hips. Wow! <laughs> Come on, little lady. Why don't you give it a whirl? I think we needed it, too. <laughs> Until the day our victory at Fanfare rings out through all of Midgar, our battle will rage on. <laughs> I'm just kidding. If it isn't Cloud. Hmm? The man with a gun for an arm. What? Got a problem? No, but you might. Corneo's men are searching high and low for an avalanche member who fits your description. Shinra has placed a very impressive bounty on you and your friends' heads. And a lot of people are looking to get rich. Ain't these fools got anything better to do? You should also know that you and that arm of yours were spotted in the Sector 5 slums. Apparently, you were loitering in a rather lovely flower garden. Oh, yeah? Wait. This is bad. Really bad. Let's move. Hey, it's him! Gun arm! Heard you punks were looking for me. Didn't want to keep you waiting. Wait, you? Ah, should have known you were one of them. But am I? Whatever. Enough of this bullshit. Hey, let him loose. Uh, sure. Ha. Y'all are in for a world of hurt now. Pack him to bits, you hear me? Leave the faces, though. Shinrai ain't gonna give us the bounty otherwise. <laughs> You're nothing special! I got your number. Ha! I didn't say you could send this one out. You got this! Okay, let's go! Come on! Can you fight? Take your shot! Gotcha! Now you're ready to kill us. I've got you covered. Gotcha! Deal 
with that. Gotta stick it out till the end. Nice, very nice, right? Shake it off, okay? Taking over. Take a shot! Shit. Keep it together. Mind over man. Let me see. Say a word to no one about you being here. Really. Honest. That's right. You'll tell everyone we were never here. That the rumors were bullshit. And if we hear about you or any of your friends coming around here ever again, you'll answer to my boot. Yes, sir. Uh, miss. I know you. You're Eret's bodyguard. I could really use her help. She always knew where to find the best. You haven't seen her, have you? I used up all my meds treating people injured when the plate fell, you see. I could make more, but not without those herbs. So what do you need? You mean you're willing to help me out? Oh, thank you. You'd be doing this town a huge favor. Here's a list of everything I'm looking for. Oh, did you manage to get everything I needed? Thank you. This ought to be more than enough. I can see why Aerith put her trust in you. Don't worry. I'll take it from here. You've done more than your fair share already. Here, take this. I'm betting it'll come in handy. It's been hours now. Don't you think you've done enough? Believe me. I have enough. No, nope. not yet. Andy, Cloud, how are you? I was hoping you knew a way we could get topside. Hmm. Sorry, but it, it's not possible. Well, well. What do we have here? I can see you're someone who likes to train to be the very best. Me? Your physique, slender yet toned and that perfectly balanced symmetry. I can tell from a glance that you learn from the best there is. But your muscles look tight, which can only mean one thing. You're conflicted. Tifa? Excuse me. You're Tifa, right? While you're here, want to give Andy a run for his money? Work up a sweat, release some endorphins. It's the answer to everything, I promise. I'm in, if you are. All right, then. The winner will be the one who does the most pull-ups. Let's not disappoint each other. Good. 
Bested me, Tifa. I can't believe I won. Your fiery passion pushed me to my limits and helped me to overcome my lingering stress and fatigue. I'll be taking the stage tonight in the best condition of my life. Thank you. No, thank you for the same. To commemorate the evening, I would be honored if you joined me on stage for a performance someday. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell anyone. But I heard Don Quixote was missing. You're kidding. No one's home. Long time no see. What brings you back here? Well, we need to find a way to get topside as quickly as possible. And we figured Corneo ought to know one. Is that so? In that case, I can help. You serious? Then tell us! Follow me. Hmm. Let's just hear him out. <clears throat> so, what's the deal with the hole? Unfinished business. If you three give me a hand with it, I'll give you what you need to get topside. You want us to go back into the sewers with you? What's down there? Corneo's hidey hole. That's where I'm headed. You're not gonna try to screw us over, are you? If that's what you think, walk away. I'll find somebody else to work with. And you'll have to find another way to get topside. All right, we're in. Say what? He betrays us, he dies. Fine by me. He means it. I'll tell you more after we've climbed down. When you're good to go, let me know. You guys ready? Okay, follow me.
Seriously, what's the deal with the hole? It's a trap for the Don's enemies. What? No one's ever gotten out alive. Well, until recently, that is. You are gonna hold up your end of the bargain, right? Long as you hold up yours, yeah. I don't trust you and I don't like you. So if you so much as breathe in a suspicious way, I'll turn that face of yours into a honeycomb. I'd save you bullets for the monsters if I were you. Some are a lot tougher than you'd think. Hate to say it, but I can barely take them on my own. You, on the other hand, shouldn't have any trouble, am I right? Let's get this over with. Head for the trunk line. It marks the border with Sector 7. You three, I'll follow a short distance behind. You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. Shower. Oh, 
don't have a plan. Good sweat. The Mark of Avalanche. Right. Jesse and Big stashed a skeleton key down here. I never got the chance to thank them for what they did. Tifa. Let's just keep moving, okay? Hate to interrupt, but the trunk line's just through that door. The one over there? Yeah, we heard you.
Wasn't this locked before? Your time to shine. Clear the path ahead, would you? Yeah, yeah. Can I ask you something? Why did you help us out before? You could have lost everything. Andrea, he told me to. That really it? And I couldn't bring myself to let it happen again. Huh? It doesn't matter. Let's go. Close to Corneo's hideout. From here on, I'll take the lead. This is it. Yeah. So how are we supposed to get topside? Through here. Then you're telling me we're not done? Sorry, guys, but it's not that simple. <laughs> Without it, we're screwed. Let's go. Coming through.
Nothing we can't handle. Take the right. I'm on it. Your days are numbered, Rat Boy. Yeah! 
Give it back. That's... Give it back. That's not a key. Sorry. That's not your pendant either. Were they family? No. It was all just a dream, wasn't it? But one day? No. Time to wake up and forget. Six months ago. On that day, Corneo picked her as a bride, and on the next, she vanished without a trace. But before she did, she gave it back. Salt on the wound. Thing cost me a small fortune. Why did you want to come down here? Revenge. I know I need to let go, but I can't. I need closure, because without it, I'll never be able to move on. It's fine. As long as you get us topside, we're still in. Thanks. And don't worry. I got you. You all right. I know a shortcut. Follow me. That twisted piece of shit. I'm gonna enjoy beating him to a pulp. Corneo's mine, and mine alone. Huh? Wait outside. Think the kid's gonna be okay going it alone? It's Leslie! Got some urgent info for the Don! <laughs> Come alone? Of course. Really? Without my little avalanche kittens? I thought I told you to round them up and bring them to me. Actually, it's them I came to talk about. Hmm. Ah. Uh. I think I need to remind you why I'm down here. Spilling the beans to those three escape artists was a serious mistake. Now I'm on Shinra's shit list. The plate stunt was meant to be an unprecedented tragedy, claiming countless innocent lives. But those naughty little kittens organized an evacuation and screwed up the plan. I'll let you in on a secret. Shinra is going to abandon Midgar and build something close to paradise. I was invited to be a part of it, 
dawn of a new and improved wall market! I'll be lucky to live another week. Leslie, I was going to let you run your own place, give you a piece of the action. What a shame. Pop quiz time, kiddo. Villains like us only divulge our evil plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation, hmm? Think again, Don. Huh? It's you. You were talking about the Sector 7 plan. Keep talking, asshole. Ah! Over there! Over there, look! Don't try to bullshit us. But that's the thing. It's not technically bullshit when it's true. Uh. <laughs> 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 Feel free to play with your food. Gone out. Bastard. <laughs> First him, then Corneo.
You okay? Where's Cornell? Sorry, bastard got away. Uh, it's fine. I'll track him down eventually. Not like I have anything better to do. You know, I wouldn't be so sure about that. Uh. She could still be out there. Can never be sure how much someone means to you till they're gone. Don't give up on her yet. Was it a message? What was she trying to tell me? We'll meet again. It's a symbol of reunion. <laughs> then I guess I've got no choice but to find her first. <laughs> Thanks. Hold up. I think you might be forgetting something. I haven't. Found it. Let's get out of here, and then I'll give you what you need. This way. <laughs> Grappling guns. You can practically fly with the souped up motors on these babies. Sector 7 is on the other side of that wall. The guns will get you over and past it, along with any number of other obstacles. But, they're one-way tickets. So once you start up, there's no coming back. You should probably get your affairs in order, just in case. Thank you. Didn't tell you before, but we're looking for someone, too. That right. Hope you find it. You too. Ready to do this? Once we start up that wall, we won't be coming back here anytime soon. So, when this is over, you gonna go on being a merc? That's the plan. Reckon it suits you. Yeah, it does. Used to think you were a little shit with a big attitude and a bigger inferiority complex. Quite possibly the worst person I have ever met. But that was before I figured you out. 
All this, it ain't you. Deep down, you're a pretty nice guy. Didn't see it when we were kids, but... Don't know about any of that. But kindness is no use on the battlefield. If anything, it's a liability. Hey, no one's asking you to treat Shinra with kid gloves. <sighs> Aerith's up there waiting for us. Then we better get a move on, huh? Ready?